diagram. So, as we know, to understand and represent some of the huge and complex statistical data in most effective and simplest manner, so that it will be attractive and easy to understand for the user. One of the method is to present the data diagrammatically. So basically graph, diagram, we are using in a similar way, but there is certain difference between it. In your syllabus, there is only diagram. Now what is the importance of diagram? So diagram represents the data in attractive, simple and concise form. So a large complex data can be easily represented. A person who is using it can easily understand. Even a person without statistical or mathematical background can easily understand it because it is in generally pictorial form. The characteristics of data expressed by diagram are remembered for a longer time. It is pure science. A visualization is more effective rather than words. So when two or more sets of data are presented by diagram on the same same scale, the comparative study of those data becomes very simple, as I explained in economics, to make comparison, time-based comparison and place-based comparison can be done easily with the help of diagram. Then diagrams have visual representation of data, so one can save time for studying the data, rather than going through the numbers, paragraph, words, description, you can easily memorize the information or data for a longer period of time within short frame of time. The core character means the main character is the main point of the data can be easily conveyed through diagram. Even a person who does not have that much education or even if the person is illiterate, less educated, can easily understand it. By using diagram, industrialist businessmen can make effective advertisement for their product. They can promote their product, okay, how much their product is being demanded by different uh, segment of customer during last five years, during last 10 years, how much sales is witnessed by that product or how much growth in that product. Then diagrams are very useful for conveying the message related to social reforms effectively. Okay, for example, some of the measures or policy initiated by government and how effective it is. A vaccination program initiated by government. So when it was started and when government is carrying, uh, carrying it on throughout last two years. So how, how much population has been covered by vaccination program? Okay. Then if government has implemented certain employment program to remove unemployment, how effective the employment program has been to remove the unemployment? How much new job opportunity have been created? So all this information can be easily presented by way of graph or diagram. Picture and diagram are easy to understand irrespective of language barrier. It does not require any type of languages. Share presentation of data in the pictorial form. So it is very easy to understand. Then limitation. If diagram is not drawn accurately, then it leads to wrong interpretation. The proper diagram drawn up, this is a law. That may be misled. Sometimes illusionary effect of diagram misled the public opinion. Ignoring the facts, figures, numbers, words, if we just focus on diagram or graph, it may not give you the exact result. There is a loss of accuracy of data by diagrammatic representation. In some cases, a fraction of change will lead to major disaster. And in diagram or graph, you cannot maintain that much accuracy. Okay, 2.579. That is the exact measure on the graph. Or now. And sometimes this degree is very important. I will make an example. Suppose 
सीम्पल डिवाइडेड बार डायग्राम अने परसेंटेज डिवाइडेड बार डायग्राम फर्स्ट बार डायग्राम डी मोस्ट इजी बार डायग्राम इस कंस्ट्रक्टेड बाय कंसीडरिंग ओनली वन कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स ऑफ डेटा तब जब क्या एग्जांपल जाए तो हम आपके जो फैकल्टी और स्ट्रीम कार्ड साइंस कॉमर्स इंजीनियरिंग मेडिकल लॉ नंबर ऑफ स्टूड So when the information is defined only on one characteristics or one feature, you can represent it through bar diagram. Bar means the vertical bar. Okay, now main characteristics. If कोई भी bar है, any length है, चाहे any height है, it will change according to value. But any जो width है, चाहे any breadth है, it should be same. One centimeter to one centimeter बस जाए. Base centimeter to base centimeter. Then distance between two consecutive bar should be equal. A K centimeter no gap for the two, but then A K no. Base no for the two, base. But now take consecutive. A is not our value. But if the height is length is, it should be according to its value. Well, illustration 23 information regarding number of students studying in a college in different faculties in a year is given below represent it by a suitable diagram okay tamara the graph has i guess ऑलमोस्ट 20 बाय 26 सेंटीमीटर की हाइट है और और 20 सेंटीमीटर की हाइट में यानी वेट है मतलब वर्टिकली 25 टू 26 सेंटीमीटर और और इसको हॉरिजॉन्टली ऑलमोस्ट 20 सेंटीमीटर बराबर नाउ एक्स एक्सिस पर जनरली फैकल्टी टाइम ये बदल रहा है और वाई एक्सिस पर वैल्यूज जे चेंज था मतलब कि ये नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट पर ये बस स्केल मेजर ले ऊपर है और तुम्हारा ग्राफ में तुम ड्रॉ करो तो मैं तुमने की दूं कि 26 सुधी है और ये हाईएस्ट वैल्यू कितनी है 1300 बराबर तो वी कैन टेक 1 सेंटीमीटर इज इक्वल टू 100 स्टूडेंट बराबर वे बीजे को सु ध्यान रखो नहीं कि जब भी तुम्हारा डायग्राम हो ग्राफ हो It should not be too small or too large. If I put a nano, be nice. If I put a magnifying glass, then check. If I put a nano, then nano, nano, nano. And if I put a small, be nice. If I put a paper, then graph paper, then nano. Nah, proportion, ha. Huh? Graph paper, then just say it. Should not be too large. Should not be too small.
Number of students. Arts, Commerce, Science, Engineering, Medical, Law. So basically six. Okay. Either I can keep a distance of one centimeter or two centimeter. बराबर तो चिकलो छे ये प्रमाण तुम्हारे डिसाइड करूं पड़े। Ideally one or two centimeter मैंने width से ले पढ़ाई it should be one centimeter or two centimeter पर जब भी width रहा कोई बदला मस सेम होगी तो एक पत्तों एक जार में उन्हें चाहे भी जो बे डायग्राम बच्चे को distance भी सेम होगी एक एक नो क्या छोड़ो तो एक एक बे बे नो छोड़ो तो बे बराबर वे मैक्सिमम वैल्यूज है थर्टीन हंड्रेड तो हमारे ये तो मेजर अलग आउट से तमारा ग्राफ करता है हंड्रेड हंड्रेड टू हंड्रेड फोर हंड्रेड फाइव हंड्रेड सिक्स हंड्रेड सेवेन हंड्रेड एट हंड्रेड Nine hundred, then zero hundred, twelve hundred, and last one thirteen hundred. Where arts ma je five hundred. This is arts. Then, um, babbe no gap chodu. Then, commerce mare thirteen hundred. Thirteen hundred hai na, twelve hundred ki ek two hundred. Then science nine hundred. Then 
then engineering four hundred. Then medical two hundred. Then law. Three hundred. बराबर? Suppose three fifty हो तो four hundred ना three hundred नहीं बच्चे आ रहे। तो हमारे क्राफ्ट में एक सेंटीमीटर ना देर भी ten boxes। तो suppose three hundred and ten के, तो three hundred ऊपर एक box। three hundred and ninety के, तो four hundred में भी एक box ही है। बराबर? एक तो हमारे calculation करी, है ना? You have to represent. So this is how simple bar diagram can be drawn. एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट थ्री सम नंबर टू द डेटा ऑन द प्रॉफिट ऑफ कंपनी इज एज अंडर प्रेजेंट इट By an appropriate diagram. Yeah. Or year, up you have, and a profit in crore rupees, up you have. Ten five minus two four eight six. So that means the minus two up here. That means loss. So minus two up here, that means zero only down. Ah, that means it's not our job. It's a little more up here. So accordingly, we have to draw the line. Right. So on x-axis we will take year, and on y-axis we will take profit. In crore rupees, your maximum value ten. Yeah. 
I can take one centimeter is equal to one crore. You can take one centimeter is equal to fifty lakh or two centimeter is equal to one crore. So our graph sufficient large enough. Whatever. Yeah. Accordingly, you can take the measure. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Niche minus two. Minus one, yeah. So minus one, minus two, minus. Whatever. No. Last graph, man, so good. You put a graph. The bar is any bit per one centimeter. Rakhi, then distance two centimeter. Do it. Or you also be able to do it. Then five rows. Then minus two rows. Then four rows. Then eight rows. And six rows. You can see. Ah, this is bread. The same thing, but then, and the distance is A B C. Remember, it has to be. Okay. हाँ माइनस तो नीचे जाओ ना हमारा फोर क्वार्टर है ना क्या अच्छा क्या नहीं हमारा फोर क्वार्टर है ना एक्स वाई वाई डेस एक्स डेस प्लस प्लस जी Plus, minus, 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 plus. Whatever, right? So this was simple part. Now. मल्टीपल बार डायग्राम एडजस्टेंट बार डायग्राम और क्लस्टर बार डायग्राम मतलब सेम तो अब इनफॉरमेशन सेम टाइप नहीं हो पर हमें सब डिवीजन जिनका आगे ना सम्मा फैकल्टी 
and the number of students who are classification boys and girls. Remember, so there is a course that they are carbon. A boys, no, a girls. Remember, boys, girls, boys, girls, boys. Remember, so this is called adjacent or cluster bar diagram or multiple bar diagram. Sometimes from the edge. Remember, then you. What are the population? So, I'm a male, female, children. So, third day, third bar. Depends. But our answer is that our economics must be outside. The rest of the economics must be repeated. Okay. Okay. The information regarding production in lakh and sales in lakh rupees for a factory during five years is given below. Present it in a suitable diagram. So the five years no data after the time regarding production and sales. So every year production get to and the sales get to that you have to represent in form of a diagram. Sometimes they will specify the sometimes they will not. So the time they present it in a suitable diagram. So you must know when to apply this diagram. But if you have a type of information, you have to write. बराबर है ना सब डिवीजन हो रहा है तो मैं कितने होंगे बॉयज गर्ल्स अर्बन रूरल मेल फीमेल प्रोडक्शन सेल्स रिलेटेड टू सेरियल देन इट शुड बी मल्टीपल बार डायग्राम और यू कैन से एडजेसेंट बार डायग्राम और क्लस्टर बार डायग्राम Here. Here we have taken and from. Maximum one sixty here. बराबर Y axis one centimeter is equal to twenty lakh rupees. Now, good. The joke book you have done, I will share it with you. Now, 
Production. At type number one, that would be sales. Now, 2011 production is 120 lakh rupees. And sales is 140. Then two thousand twelve production one fifty one sixty and one forty what two and sales is one forty five. So one fifty and one forty in that. Then one hundred thirty and one forty. So it will be between one hundred twenty and one hundred forty. Then one forty and one sixty. One sixty and one fifty. Yeah. This is called multiple or cluster. But then what is it? Faculty of commerce, science, engineering, arts, medical law. And the number of boys, number of girls. So first one commerce, 700. Boys, 600 girls. Then, 
साइंस में फाइव हंड्रेड बॉयज फोर हंड्रेड गर्ल्स बराबर सेम वे इंजीनियरिंग आर्ट्स मेडिकल एंड लॉ ओके सो व्हेन सेम टाइप ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन हैविंग सब डिवीजन और सब डेटा तो इट विल बी रिप्रेजेंट टू मल्टीपल और एडजेसेंट और यू कैन से क्लस्टर मॉडल 